hotties welcome to today's video i'm going to be showing you 15 back to school outfit ideas and there's an emphasis on the word ideas i know that every single one of these outfits probably don't comply to all of your like individual dress code needs um i'm in college so i don't have a dress code and i know a lot of high schools don't either but if you have a dress code and some of these don't perfectly fit i feel like these ideas will kind of get the ball rolling on like some silhouettes or just like color schemes you want to go for I think a pair of overalls is going to be a major staple for this back to school season. I just got this pair and I'm really excited about it. I feel like you can match it with a lot of different tops. Today I paired it with this adorable puka baby tee. I think the coloring matches each other really well. And since these overalls are really baggy, I thought that like a tight fitted crop top was the way to go. To match with the light coloring of the top, I decided to go for these white sneakers. They're not so white anymore, um, but I mean, the effort is there. You really can't go wrong with a baby tee and some light wash low rise jeans. I know not all of us love low rise, but I do. Finding your everyday pair of jeans, I feel like is really essential, especially for back to school. You're, you just wake up, you're like, I don't want to figure out what I want to wear today. You always know you can count on these and just throw on any top and it'll match well. So this has been one of my favorite outfits lately. I just wear this one so much, but I know that the little boy shorts are a little bit questionable, but I still really like it. I thought I would kind of break like the little boy esque miss of it by putting on a like black little crop top, but still keeping it simple and chic um, in the color palette. If your misogynistic dress code doesn't allow you to wear um, cropped tank tops, you could always throw on a little bit of overshirt to cover up. I do admit, I do look like a little farm boy, but I'm also not mad about it. You could always change out the colors and just switch it up to make it look like a different outfit, even though it's really not. Having socks peek out of your low rise is a little preppy accessory in itself, and it's something that I will be doing a lot this year. If you're looking for something a little bit more modest or you know will comply with the stupid ass dress code, um, this is the perfect one for you. This shirt is pretty fitted so it still kind of like makes it not look too much like a box if you want to wear low-rise jeans but you don't want to show your that was hot um, if you don't want to show your belly then obviously wearing a longer shirt will kind of combat that but you still kind of have like the same look of the tiny little zipper and for this one i matched all of like the light detailing together the thing I love about these kinds of tops is that you can really control how much belly you want to show. You can make it a little bit more high rise or low rise. This is personally where I'm comfortable with and it's a very nice and springy color palette. I'm sweating so much right now, but something that I learned to make like the knot look so like gross and protruding was that when you tie it, just know, so okay, this one is the one that's going to be going over and under first and then you're going to take the one that was doing that even though it started off on this side you're still going to work with this one and then knot it again cool yeah i love wearing big sweater vests on their own and obviously they give very much preppy school vibes and i think adding a pair of doc martens or just like big chunky shoes with some distressed jeans really edges it up a bit going for that same baggy on baggy silhouette i threw on this really cool graphic team and i really like the color i think it adds like a nice pop of color without being too in your face loud if you're trying to go for that like 2013 tumblr grunge era wow that was a good time i feel like this outfit is perfect for you i have this kind of oversized uh but light colored sweater and i thought that uh these distressed shorts were perfect so they can kind of peek out a little this one's really nice for like when the school year has like that really weird period of time where it's cold but also too hot to wear jeans and a sweater if the last one was a little bit too scandalous and sexy for you i understand it kind of just looks like you're not wearing pants um you could always have the same kind of look with a pair of baggy distressed jeans in an attempt to make this mini dress a little bit more school appropriate i thought i would throw on this button up to kind of cover up the spaghetti straps and make it a little bit more modest but it is a really short dress anyways so you know, wear one that you feel comfortable in and that you won't get suspended for for some fucking weird reason. If you're uncomfortable with wearing a mini dress to school or like, I don't know, you just want to have like your ass in your coochie out, 
potentially. Um, you can always wear a nice little romper. I feel like this is the perfect solution and this one looks like a dress. Um, so you kind of get the best of both worlds. So this one's definitely for my college folks out there. I know this one's a little bit kind of much, but I love being extra at school. You can't wear sandals. You could always change them for like a pair of docks or just sneakers. I feel like it's very versatile with this outfit, but I thought I would switch up the shoes a little bit. I also just love the sleek look of a black mini skirt with a high neck line top. We're ending off very casual here folks. Also my hair is up now because the sweat is getting out of control. I'm sorry if that's nasty. It's just true. It's just what I have to do for you guys. But uh, yeah, I thought I would just try to style sweatpants. Obviously sweatpants are super comfortable for school, but sometimes you don't want to look like you're wearing straight up PJs. And I thought this baseball tee kind of gave it a little bit more casual, but not too sleepy look. Okay, I hope you enjoyed today's video. Maybe you thought of some outfit ideas you want to wear to look super hot in front of everyone because you are hot and I think like wearing clothes that make you feel confident just helps you perform better and just feel like in a less shitty mood about being in school. Okay, I love you. Bye!